Vlogmas part 8. Sorry, it's a bit of a rushed um, start to the Vlogmas this morning. I'm already out and about. It's about half past nine. Um, I've come to Embankment, nice and scenic, and I'm just about to meet a photographer um, and we're going to shoot some outfit photos. I've got some Christmas jumpers with me and lots of nice festive outfits. So yeah, we're going to have a little photo shoot. We're going to try Somerset House. But I know they don't really like you to do photos there. So we'll see if we get kicked out or not. Wish us luck. now productive morning doing photos and I've just written a blog post and scheduled a video so feeling super duper productive I'm about to head out now um, god look how much makeup I've got on this gross I'm about to head out now to go to the post office to post some giveaway prizes I just had like a mass session of um, emailing people that had won stuff so I'm gonna quickly show you what today's prizes are before I head out they are really really super today again I really want to keep them um, but I can't so let me show you so first of all we've got this ginormous set um, which is the Amazing Grace set from Philosophy. So inside this huge box, you have got these three lovely items. This is a ginormous um, shampoo, bath and shower gel. It's one of these like triple multitasking products, which smells heavenly. And then you've got the fragrance, the Amazing Grace perfume. And I believe this is a body souffle. Yeah, whipped body creme. How nice does that sound? Gosh, so that's the, um, that's kind of the main prize. So you've got that lovely big set and the box itself is just beautiful. Um, and then I've got a Mary Kay blusher. So this is like a mini compact um, uh, little blusher in there. Um, a nice big, you could use this as maybe like a foundation brush or a powder brush. It's from a brand called Doll 10. And then from Josie Moran, I have a brand new foundation brush. Also, and finally, there is this beautiful set from Doll Tan, and inside you have got blushes and everything you need for a good contour and bronze. So you've got some really beautiful shades in there. So that is today's prize. I'm actually gonna um, do this on my blog. So what you've got to do is just go and check out the latest blog post, which is a gift guide. And in there you'll see a little raffle copter um, and just fill that out to win that. So I'll leave a link down below. So good luck guys to win this little set. Back from the post office now. I'm sorry this vlog seems a little bit bitty, like I'm going here, I'm going there, I'm back from here. Um, so I'm just gonna show you a little bit of um, some haulage, some stuff which is just arrived in the post. There is this. I don't think you can really tell the magnitude of the size of that box from that little clip. So if you compare the box to the size of my room, my room isn't that big, but the box literally fills it. Um, that I will do next, but first I'm gonna do a little ASOS mini haul because I was looking on ASOS a little while ago for some Christmas dresses and I bought quite a few to um, choose from. I don't have time to try them on because I'm going to my mum's in a second, um, but I'm gonna hang them all up and you guys can help me decide which ones to keep. the four dresses I think I know already which one I like the most um, so let's start with this one I think they're all the same brand I'm sure they're all um, no they're not okay so this one here this black lace one is by self portrait it's probably gonna come to around the mid shin area so quite a long one um, but I really like how it's like black lace but it's still really delicate with these nice thin straps um, and I think this detail here I'm not sure if you can see but it's clear here I think that'll look really lovely so really depends on the length if that's gonna be flattering on me or not um, but yeah that's really really cute and then a nice little V down at the back so that's option number one I'll leave um, links for these down below so you guys can shop them if you really really like them this one I'm really not too sure on so it's a pink one I believe it's ASOS own brand um, 
but it was getting a little bit stuck together here. Like the material, you can see the gold is kind of flaking away a little bit. So yeah, not too sure about that one, but there's a kind of full length version of it. This one here I think is my favourite. It's white, it's kind of t-shirt style at the top um, with this kind of beautiful little crochet, but then there's a bandeau on the boob area, um, a little frilly kind of top. And then around the waist you've got this almost like little lace tutu and then a beautiful little lace with almost like a daisy print um, on the skirt. I think the length and the shape of that one is just gorgeous. And then this is very similar to the black one but in white, in fact I think it's pretty much the same. Oh, what was that? Strange noise. Um, so again you've got the clear section and it's a lovely lovely elegant length but I think this is just a little bit too summery. I might try it on if I fall in love with it then um, we'll keep it but otherwise I think this is the winner. This is about as far as I can get with bringing the other box into the room so I'm going to leave it there um, and unpack it and then bring everything onto the bed to show you what is inside. Okay so I just want to apologise right now if you're expecting something very um, fashionable or beauty related because it's not. It's actually a load of really useful home stuff um, but I'm going to show you anyway because you know we all need home stuff. So my wonderful selection of products here is from TK Maxx. I absolutely love getting home stuff from TK Maxx, they have really good brands um, but you don't have to pay an absolute fortune for them. I think these pillows should have been over £100 for a pair but I didn't even pay much more than £100 for all of this stuff. So let's start with the pillows. The pillows in this room, this is our kind of spare bedroom, are so embarrassingly flat I just apologise profusely for anybody staying in here. So I decided to get some nice pillows. These, this is a really amazing brand and it was quite literally about 75% off which is crazy. So I've got some duck feather and down pillows um, and like straight away tomorrow morning I'm going to swap these manky ones for this lovely set. So yeah, got the pillows. Then, as you can see, got a rather ginormous dog bed. So Dexter has a really big cage downstairs, um, but it's almost too big and we don't want to go buying another cage. So I thought if I've got a really big dog bed, then um, it'll make it really cozy in there for him. And this is almost like a bean bag for dogs. So it's got this zippy, um, oh, what is it? I think this is the brand. Live, love, bark. <laughs> that's really cute. Um, yeah, it's got a removable cover, so if he has any accidents, then that's fine. So yeah, really big dog bed. I think he's going to absolutely love this. Then we got a snuggle down of Norway. That sounds rather fancy. Um, Thermofill duvet. So these are these really fancy ones that... Um, they don't make you too hot and don't make you too cold, they're basically like temperature regulating. And again, that's for this bedroom here, because the bedding, I think I must have got it when I was a student or something, because it's so naff and just embarrassing for anybody that stays here. This, again, was more than half price. I would never be able to afford such a fancy duvet for my spare room, um, but TK Maxx had a really good offer, so got the duvet. I wonder how many viewers I've lost already by talking about all this kind of home stuff. Um, but then I've got a double duvet set. The one I've got at the moment is from H&M and it's just not the best quality. So I've got this one. It's a brand called, I think it was like Bella something. Or maybe Hotel 21 is the brand. Um, so this is just the bottom sheet. And then I got a Bella Luxe top sheet. It's just quite plain with like a lacy detail on the edges and the matching pillowcases. So that's pretty much like the full bedding. So we've got the bedding, the duvet and the pillow, so pretty much this entire bed sorted. And then last but not least I got another little outfit for Dexter because he genuinely gets pretty cold in the winter so it's nice to give him something to wear. I'll just get this out and show you. This is actually too cute. <laughs> so you've got this little like kind of Santa's hat here. This is a picture of the dog wearing it. Dexter's not going to look anything like that. And then it's almost like a Father Christmas but a green version. And then he's got his scissors, his hammer, his little candy cane. Oh my gosh. It looks quite big so I might have to like take it in a little bit. How bloody adorable is that? I love it. So yeah, that is my little mini TK Maxx haul. I'm really pleased with all the bargains that I got. And as I said, I think I probably spent about £120 on all of this and the dog bed. So yeah, did pretty well. Thanks TK Maxx. 
And now I'm just going to quickly um, edit the thumbnail for the vlog that's going live in about an hour and then I'm going to head off to mum's house. Alright, video thumbnail done. I'm now going to head out um, to mum's house. I'm going to leave the camera behind because I've already got too much stuff to carry. So I'm going to film on the iPhone because it wasn't too bad the other day. So. See you later. So we've just come to one of my mum's friend's house and I have a little special guest here, Maisie, Hi. and show everybody what you're wearing. So Maisie's got the Krispy Kreme ambassador jacket because um, it's her birthday next week. Woo! Cheers to Maisie. What's your name, sweetie? Olivia. And who have you got down there? Dexter. Is he behaving? Yeah. yeah. Is he really? Olivia is being dragged around the house by Dexter. <laughs> so, what are you going to do for your birthday next week? Um, well, on Friday, I'm just going to have my family around. Yeah. And then the week after, uh, my friends and I are just going to have a sleepover and get very high on sweets. Naughty! You're welcome to come! <laughs> Yay! Beastie! Are you being a beastie? Hello? I'm gonna get a little shot of all the champagne, and biscuits, and food. He's just following us. I know, Nan's got all out this year. So, Mum's friend's house has literally got the best Christmas decorations ever. Look at the Argo behind me and all the decorations above it. So cute! <laughs> So Maisie's currently washing her mouth out with soap because <laughs> tell us what you did, darling. Um, there's a body mist on the table and I was holding it and I sprayed it and it went all over my mouth. Oh, so you didn't actually think it was food? No, I didn't think it was food. Oh. It looked delicious, but I didn't think it was food. All right, I thought you thought it was food. <laughs> hey, Hello. Oh, little oh. Oh. What have you got there, Olivia? This Feel it. Oh, it's very soft. You have to put it on so we can Dex see it. Is loving it. <laughs> so it is quarter to ten now. We've had a really fun day. I've been with Maisie and Olivia and Dexter. <laughs> Dexter always yawns. Um, but we've had a really fun afternoon, um, just chilling, and I think we're all going to go to bed now because we're pretty knackered. Look at them kissing, so cute. So I hope you guys have enjoyed today's vlog. Give it a thumbs up if you have, and I'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye. Bye. Bye.